Hi, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to insert an image into a shape in Photoshop. If you're ready, let's dive right into the video. Alright, so for this tutorial, I'll be using Photoshop 2020. But um, this, the, the method I'll be showing in this video works for any version of Photoshop. Alright, so okay, so you start a new project, you come to create new. Alright, you label it um, whatever you wish to. I can just title it insert insert an image in Photoshop. Come to the dimension. Alright, um, okay, you can leave yours in pixels or inches. So I think I like uh, maybe four by four. Okay, so I just change it to four height and width 4.0 inches respectively okay then um, pixels per inch you can leave it um, I think at default 72 that's if you're not printing okay but if you are printing you you have to increase the resolution to maybe 300 all right but since I'm not printing this design okay I can leave it at the default which is 72 all right so then your color mode set it to RGB that's if you're not going to print it all right but if you are printing it should be cmyk all right so since i'm not going to print this design i'll just leave it at um, rgb all right so you click okay custom okay so you leave the other um settings at that default settings and then you click create all right so this is the commands we are we have successfully created a new photoshop file all right so now the next thing is to insert the our background image all right so i come to i look at where the files are on my computer so this is th these are all right so these are the files all right so these are the files that we'll be using for the project so this is our background image and this is our the image that we are going to be inserting inside the shape all right so you come okay so i click um okay, right click and select open in photoshop all right okay so we wait for that to open up in photoshop so all right so this is our background image now you hold this and drag to your canvas all right okay now you can reduce the size because you, so you can reduce the size of the image to fit into the background all right okay just to fit into the background all right so i think we are we are good to go on this one all right now we go back to where to our files on okay where our files is located on the computer and then insert our image all right so here we go again okay right click and select open in photoshop all right so this is the image that we are going to be inserting into our shape in photoshop so we go back to the um canvas all right so now the next step is to draw our shape all right so this method works for any shape whether a circle a triangle a rectangle whatever but for this design i'm going to be using a circle all right okay so you come to your okay your two bars here and locate the shape icon okay so this is where we have the different um, shapes in photoshop you have the rectangle rounded triangle but for this tutorial we're going to be using the ellipse tool all right so you you click your ellipse tool all right and draw okay draw the shape on your canvas now why we hold the shape key is that so that we can get an even um an even shape an equal shape okay of whatever we are drawing so take notes you have to hold your shift key and then draw so as you have an equal shape all right so now you can change the color of this um of the circle okay i think i like a white so i can come here where we have the color pin here and then just swap you click this arrow here to swap it to white or you just click where you have the black this black um color um color panel or color um shape here is called your foreground and this is the background all right so i want to change this foreground color to white which is the color on the shape so i can click the arrow this arrow beside the color um option here to swap it or i click the background or sorry the foreground color and it gives me okay it opens a color picker here and then i 
just navigate to where I have the white all right to change it to white okay okay and then okay I come here and select it to white all right so you see we have successfully changed the color of um, the shape to white all right so you can also enlarge your shape okay make it bigger all right okay so we are good to go now the next thing is to drag our image into the canvas so we now we get to the window here where our image is open all right you can just change it to okay you can rename this layer to image all right it is a good professional practice to always rename your layers all right so okay so you hold this and then drag it to where okay our background and shape is and then you let go right so you see that the the image is bigger way bigger than your camera so you just reduce it okay you reduce it and then you zoom out right after that okay you can zoom out zoom out again all right so now take note okay. all right so we have successfully okay so we have successfully dragged our image into um our design our background and our shape now what's the next step the next step is to now insert this image inside the circle so how do we do that very simple all right so you you come to where you have your layers here okay you come to where you have your layers here now you right click on your image all right right click on your image and select create clipping mask all right there are two ways to do this actually one you can come to layer all right and select create clipping mask and here you can see that there's a shortcut alt ctrl g all right alt ctrl g is the shortcut to um, get this done but we are not going to be using the shortcut for this tutorial we are going to use the normal direct route all right so you come to layer and select ensure that your image um image layer is selected all right ensure your image layer is selected so you come to layer okay on your menu bar and go to create clipping mask so you click all right so you see that what the image has been clipped into the circle all right now you can expand the image to fit into the circle all right just like this just like this so you see you have successfully clipped the image or inserted the image into the shape okay now let me show you the other way to do this all right so we can just go ahead and press ctrl z to undo what we've done all right so the second way to get this done is right here in the layer panel ensure that your image layer is selected and then you right click on the image and select create clipping mask okay so you see we have also inserted the image or successfully inserted the image into the shape all right so you can also adjust the image okay inside the shape whichever uh, however way you want it all right so this is how you insert an image into a shape in photoshop i'm sure you had value from this video please give the video a like share the video with your friends and also subscribe to my channel so till i see you in my next video take care of yourself and stay safe